This is Jeff Shaw. Jeff has disrupted his core in all planes of motion. Okay, so standing tall, his hips are rotated left or for him open. If you'd add, so this is measuring the back of the core and add knee flex, and this is measuring the front. And you have, how's that look, Jeff? Looks pretty good. Looks pretty good. Does it look pretty good? I can't really see from. I mean, maybe a hair open. All right. Okay. So you can't tell if you have the bar on yourself. So if you'd stand yeah. tall, I want you to make fist, and this is how you can check at home on your own. Keep my arms on my side. Uh huh. Near my chest wall. Okay. Uh -huh. Now bring your fist straight up. Which way that way? Okay. Uh -huh. You bring them all the way up. Now, which fist is higher? Feel the left one. Yep. Your left your left hand is higher. If you extend your finger straight up now. Yeah, big time. Yeah, your left, yeah. you can see how much higher your hands are. Right. Which is telling you that your core, you have an imbalance in your right. core. Right. Now, if you let that go back to the fist for just a moment, if you don't see it there as well, just let them, just relax, keep your elbows on your chest wall, let them bounce, and which ones, now your right one's higher. Yeah, I, I would like that. Yeah. Yeah. So that's a measurement that we're going to use repeatedly in looking at whether it's planes of motion, the fitness, uh, or just your general core. So if you're at home, get your stance, let your elbows drop. You'll see if one hand is higher than the other, bring your hands up. And we're going to show you core correction now and uh, how to fix that.